In one of my previous videos, I've shown you the consequences of killing Kolak. You get this extremely gorgeous and very rare robe as a reward in that process. So I was kind of upset that most of us are going to sacrifice this robe as we love Karlak so much. So in that video, I asked my audiences to comment if they know a way to get this robe without killing Karlak. To be honest, I tried to find a solution myself and at a time I started to believe it is kind of impossible. But you know what? Yesterday I got a comment from this gentleman who just discovered a way to do this. He showed me the process and I'm going to share this with you guys. Big thanks to him once again. Now without any further delay, let's do this. I'm starting from the camp while I have no one in my party. Now I'll recruit Will. That's the spirit. I need to ungroup myself from the party to make sure that I go to Karlak's place alone. Now let's visit Karlak. Do not go too close to Karlak. We need to avoid the introductory cutscene by enemies. Now attack and kill Karlak. The journal is updated and we have to talk to Will now. Let's get to Will and see his response about the kill. Your minds are as one. Will sees you attack his infernal target in his mind's eye. Karlak's defeated. Karlak is fallen. Hells, I should be celebrating. Making toasts, roaring in victory. So, why am I frozen in doubt? Tell me it was right to strike her down. Not exactly the words of solace I'd hoped for. Damn it all! I vowed to hunt vicious monsters, not join their ranks. No, Karlak blazed with the fire of Avernus. You saw it. You smelled it. Infernal essence, tip to toe. I've slain myriad devils, each one a threat to Feyru. I've torn the horns from their heads without a second thought. Why should this time be any different? My prey has fallen. Hail the blade. Hail again, and may our strikes always find their marks. Everything happened like before, right? The journal says we need a long rest now. But before the long rest, I will be visiting Dead Karlak once again. Any guess what I am going to do? I am going to revive her, but remember to keep a minimal distance between you and Karlak. Well, she is alive. Now, how is the change going to affect everything else? As Karlak is alive now, will we still get the reward? Let's find out. It's long rest time. I thought it was time I dropped by the doghouse. Mizora. The one and only. You haven't introduced me to your friend. Where are your manners? Will, you absolute stinker! You kept me a secret? Time to let the Hellcat out of the bag. Call me Mizora. I'm Will's patron, the fount of his power. Your warlock friend is my puppy. And he's been a very good boy. I say fetch, and he'll fetch. I say kill a fugitive tiefling, and... Well, I don't need to tell you. You said devils only. She was a tiefling, not a monster. Clause G, Section 9. Target shall be limited to the infernal, the demonic, the heartless, and the soulless. Do 
Cheer up, Buttercup. Karlak had no heart. You did the world a favor. More to the point, you obeyed. He's the Blade of Frontiers. Devil's plaything just doesn't have the same ring. Speaking of... a pleasure. Shame that tadpole's gone and pissed on your party. But I'll be damned if it goes pissing on mine. I've got some errands to do. But don't you fret much, pup. I'll be back in three shapes of your tail. Keep an eye on him, will you? I'll be keeping mine on you. Oh, and Will, don't forget, our pact still stands. Ta-ta! It is amusing. I have tricked them and it feels pretty successful so far. But can I recruit Karlak now? I killed her before the long rest, remember? One horn. The stink of Avernus. Advocatus Diaboli. Well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. Thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. Bloody right. An honor to be chased by the Blade of Frontiers. But I... Ugh! A great heat roars through you. Her heat, fiery as the hells. Then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood. The blood war. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What was that? Evidence. Proof that you're a devil. A gladiator in the Archdevil Zariel's army. I can explain. But it's a whole situation. If you just hear me out... Another vision. Karlak's blade raised, slicing through devils. Zariel's servants, as her eyes dart around, seeking escape. Her rage and desperation seep into you. She is a victim of the Blood War, not an agent of it. She's trying to trick us. Don't believe her lies. You saw the truth. I never wanted to serve Zariel. I was enlisted in her army against my will. Forced to fight, and fight I did. When I saw an opportunity to get away, I took it. Finally home. Near it anyway. You served her. That's enough to damn you. Oh my god, Will, are you serious or what's going on? Is that the same man who was feeling very upset about Carl a few hours ago? You don't know what you're saying. You're asking me to trust a devil. Listen to sense now. I don't want this to end badly for either of us. You know monsters, right? Better than anyone. Look into my eyes. Can't you see I'm not what you think? Shit. You really are no devil, are you? I've... I've been deceived. Oh, thank the gods. Thought I was gonna have to take your head. <laughs> you would have died in the attempt. But there have been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye. Truce. I'm Karlak. But you already knew that. And you are... Well met, soldier. Nice to meet a friendly around here. It's been tough going so far. I may not be a devil, but I can put the Blade's reputation to work. Everything remained exactly the same like before and it is hilarious at the same time. 
Well, well, well. Now Karlak is our party member and we have the special robe at the same time. So guys, that was all for today. If you have liked this video, please consider subscribing. Have a nice day. Goodbye.